Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. I have a tip for you. I'm going to be answering someone's question. Here is a pretty well established tomato plant. Um, let's see. I think this is a homesteader uh, because the whole tree is homesteader. As you can see, it's getting established roots. And today's tip is this. Um, you up potted this as a seedling. Um, you see the two leaves on the bottom. I would suggest you pinch them out. You can see how low the soil is in there. So you want to break off the two lower leaves. Let me lift this big one up for you. You want to break off the two lower leaves and you want to fill this cup up higher with soil. So about there. So it's not flopping around and it'll make it a little bit more sturdy. So tip for the day is to check all your cups pots whatever you're using and see how big the plant is see if the soil decreased and you may have to top it off look at those beautiful roots you may have to top it off with more soil so my suggestion is is to take off the first baby leaves uh, leave the rest of the leaves and fill this pot up with soil and take it up to about there um, that will give you a more thicker, sturdier tomato. And yeah, that's my tip for the day. I can actually, oh my gosh, this homesteading tomato plant. I touched the leaves. Smells absolutely amazing. I cannot wait to start gardening. So there you have it, everyone. Check your cups, your pots um, from your seedlings that you transplant it. Uh, take those two little lower leaves off and fill this up with some more soil um, because you can see this was initially filled up to here and it's decreased by that much. Um, so yeah, check your little plants, your more established tomato plants. Take off the two lower baby leaves and fill this up. You can see it's even getting little hairs on the stems. So this needs more dirt. So there's my tip for today, and you can also straighten it as you put the dirt in there, but it's to top off your soil, check your pots, your cups, if you're using styrofoam cups, check them out, see if you have plants that need to have more soil. So that is my tip for the day. Um, yeah, I cannot get over the smell this is my first time of doing the Homesteader tomato, and it smells amazing. On that note, I hope this tip was helpful for you. Smash the like button, leave me a comment, make sure your notification bell is on, share this video, and I hope you enjoyed this tip, and I will see you on the next video. God bless everyone.